This is the Pride Wrangler scooter. Uh, this is the new addition to the Pride line. This scooter's only been out for a month. Um, when you watch the video later on after this presentation, you will see the scooter is a beast. This scooter right here has two motors in the back, and they're about three horsepower each motor, three horsepower, which equate to about 2,200 watts each motor. That's a total of 4,400 watts of power in these motors. There's no other scooter out there with this type of power right now in the market that I know of, of this type of price range and this type of tire setup. This scooter is five and a half inches off the ground at the motor. So it's five and a half inches off the ground at the back of the motor, but it's about nine inches over here, okay, from here to here. But the motor itself, the low back, is about five and a half inches off the ground. This scooter <laughs> has a 350 pound weight capability. This scooter can also go about 11 miles an hour. It has two large 75 amp batteries which will give you about 18 miles on a battery charge. If you have a very light person, not too heavy, you might get 20, 22 miles on a battery charge. You can also upgrade from the 75 amp to the 100 amp batteries, which will be a little bit of extra cost more, but you get a little more distance with the 100 amp, you just get a little more distance on the batteries. This scooter has 14 and a half inch tires. 14 and a half inch tires, they're air tires with better ride. This is 14 and a half by about five and a half to six inches. Look at the size of these tires. And look at the suspension on here. There's two of this suspension in front. You have disc brakes. Also, if you look at here, you got disc brakes on the wheel like you would have on your car. There's disc brakes on the front. And if you look at the back, look at the suspension in the back. You can see the heavy duty suspension back here with the whole seat. I don't know if we can make it. You can see the suspension here, okay? So, so far, We've covered the tires. They're 14 and a half by five, six inches wide. They're air tire for better rides. You've got a seat on here that is swivel. This is called a captain seat. You can swivel this seat around. And this seat also can also be go back and forth like this. It's on a sliding, sliding thing. It's a captain seat, so you can fold it down. And you can adjust the back with a pillow back. You can see the pillow back right here. Call a pillow back. You've got adjustable arms that go up and down like this, and these arms can also go out by adjusting these rods back here. You can adjust the arms on the way out. Okay? And I think right here you have a lumbar support right here. This is for lumbar, so if you want a little more support in here, you can turn this for lumbar support. Okay? This scooter also has a mirror. And right here in the front, you have a mirror, and right here in the front, this gray lever here, this is how you would adjust your tiller, which position you want it in. On this side, you've got a natural manual brake. So if you had to physically, the scooter already will brake automatically when you let go. But if you got nervous and you were going too fast and you wanted to hit the, you wanted to hit the disc brakes up front right here, this would give you more braking system. Okay. You've got on the front here LED lights. The, the scooter's got the whole light package. You've got anchor points here if you need to tie your scooter. You've got two here, and you also have two in the back, right back over here. You can't hardly see them, but they're under here. There's one here, and there's one here under the frame. Your two motors are right here. There's a motor here and a motor right here. If I was going to put this scooter in neutral, there's a lever. There's a little mark right here you can see. The levers are right here, right where my hands are. I can put both motors in neutral. I can roll the scooter. Okay? So, so far, Cover the scooter, um, the power it has. The length is about 61 and a quarter from here to here is about 61 and a quarter. So that's a pretty long scooter. The width of the scooter from here to here is about 31 and a half. So anyway, the width of the scooter is 32 inches or 31 and a half from outside to outside. So remember that this scooter weighs a little less than 400 pounds total weight. It does not come apart, so this is not a portable scooter. Um, the scooter also has right here, right where my hand is, uh, the reset button. So if, it, if your scooter, if you get stuck somewhere and instead of burning your motor, the reset will pop out. And this is where you would put and reset the, the reset button right there. On this display right here, you do have different modes. You have flashers, headlights, everything is on here. Your horn, that's actually a real horn. Um, and you have 
hazard lights, all your lights will flash around the scooter. It even gives you the temperature of the day on this, on this face board here. When you're driving it, you can tell how warm it is today. There's also a temperature gauge. It's fully loaded. When you charge the scooter, you will use your charger right here. The charger port for this scooter is right here. So you would plug it right there, plug it into the wall, and when the light turns green, your charger is fully charged. As I said, this scooter will go about 18 and a half miles with a lightweight person in here uh, and 22 miles with a lighter person. So 18 and a half miles with a regular standard person weight and 22 miles with a, a lightweight person. So the mileage varies depending if you're going uphill, downhill, if you have a heavy person or not. The seat on this scooter, remember this, is 18 and a half. 18 and a half wide by 16 deep. 18 and a half by 16 deep. That's the width of the seat. So this is a this is a key scooter, so you'll get two keys with your scooter. Once you take the keys out, nobody can mess with your scooter. It's a key scooter. So again, let's recap. This is, in my opinion, right now, the top of the line. And if you need a scooter to go in the backyard, you need a scooter where most scooters will not go. Remember, this scooter has two motors in the back. There are three horsepower each. Most scooters out there, powerful scooter, have one and a half horsepower. This is twice the power. Three horsepower per motor, a total of six horsepower, a total of 4,400 watts of motor power. Okay? 14 and a half inch tire by five, six inch wide, 11 mile an hour top speed. The overall rating of this scooter, the weight limit is 350 pounds. Great suspension when you're riding this scooter on the rough terrain. Uh, fantastic scooter. You have a manual brake here. You have an adjustable for your tiller. You have a mirror. You have all the displays you'll need in here for speed, temperature, fast, slow, flashers, headlights, rear light. It has everything. You have anchor points in the front, anchor points in the back. You have a swivel seat. An adjustable seat. This is a pillow top seat, meaning you, not only do you have an extra pillow on top of the seat itself to make it even more comfortable, it is an adjustable back, an adjustable headrest, fantastic scooter. If you have any question on this scooter, give us a call, but watch the video first. I think you'll be very impressed by this video on this scooter. I'm very excited about this new addition to the Pride line, and I think this will be a really, really sharp, hot item, and it's ready to go. I'm not saying you should do what I just did, but I went through some two foot tall grass over there. It's got plenty of power. As long as the wheel can track into the grass and they don't slip, the power is there. This is, you got a five, six inch of ground clearance. This is just a beast of a scooter. Right, that's that's pretty extreme there folks. I don't expect you. I'm leaning sideways so the thing don't tip over. We've had a lot of storms here in Florida. We just got we just uh, missed another big storm. So everything we have here is really wet and mushy and it had no problem going through it. It's just uh, as I said earlier, it's a beast.
Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We are a family owned business for over 25 years. We have many products available, not just what you see in this video. If you would like to learn more, you can call the number below at 800-677-6293 or you can visit us directly at www.marksmobility.com.